Hey guys, welcome to Bugs Writer Weekly. Here I'm going to just talk about some random stuff. So I was doing some rising today and I'm going to make a video and going to show you like whatever stuff I was doing. All right. So first of all, many people say rising is a waste of time. Now I believe that's bullshit because uh, there is no thing like waste of time. Okay. So also I believe like how much time you're going to spend on rising. Maybe one day I just spend like few hours. So I started using this new window manager called Hyperland and I used it dwm for two years and i did rising for dwm for like uh, okay i spent a day or two days maybe you know, figuring out everything like pywall and all the configurations and dwm was hard to you know rise and configure so i feel that uh, in dwm if i spent two days and then i ended up using my system for like two years then i think it's not a waste of time it's a really really well trade-off okay so even if I talk about Linux in general, all the time I spend learning all these skills, I feel I'm going to use all these skills in my life, like whatever rest of my life. Okay, so this is not a waste of time. Even if you're spending one year, you know, just learning how to use command line, it's going to serve you in a long term. So it's it's good, like, you know, technology, it's fun. So the thing is that I started using Hyperland. And so I was using Hyperland like for more than one month now and i never raised it okay and i had so many bad configurations and many people were asking configurations for that i mean i didn't even had proper configuration at the time my workspace look at this like it's working now previously it was not working okay so i did everything correct now like my configuration look a little bit better there are a few more things which i have to figure out but i'll figure out later so you might like this you know video wallpaper okay it's a story i'm going to tell you okay so in hyperlane uh, configuring everything was really easy and i literally loved it because when i was using dwm before or x org the thing is i was highly limited like everything i wanted to do they were not allowing me to do so i was using status bar uh, which was default dwm status bar and there was nothing i can do you know it was really hard to configure everything but in hyperland you can see i am getting video wallpaper everything whatever i want i get i'm getting it like so easily okay so i want to make a complete series about hyperland i really feel that i should just go through everything one by one because since i'm using it and i'm a youtuber now so what i can do is i can make a video like video series and then more people will use it and the community will grow kind of like what happened with dwm okay so okay so let's start the story like whatever i did today so first of all why i took one month to rise my hyperlink because i was busy living life guys okay so i was you know somewhere out um in i was on a trip and look at all the photos we clicked like we had a camera like canon camera we had an one iphone my friend had an iphone and one friend had, had one plus and i had pixel phone and then we we also created video and i organized everything so properly because i love to organize okay so i was busy living life and that's why so since this is a box writer weekly guys okay so it's not like a proper video it's i'm just going to talk about my you know whatever things i did so let's talk about rice now okay so First of all, this is Waybar on the top and I wrote the configuration for it. So I'm not releasing configuration on my Git now, uh, right now, like uh, it's because, you know, it's it's messy. It's not proper. Also, most of these configuration are just, you know, copy, copy pasta. Okay, so it's CSS, guys. So I can just like add border. No, I'm I'm really good with CSS. So I I feel like I should do all of this by myself and not like copy pasta okay but yeah i mean i i do these kind of so you can see it's so easy to manipulate anything like with css so you can just change css and everything will change accordingly now i am really confused do i really need this border in the bottom or not i guess not all right so yeah this is way bar and you only get two configuration one is this config file another is like this style.css why i'm telling you this is not a tutorial in this video i'm just going to i i will make proper hyperline videos i promise this time okay so in this video i'm just going to show you like the kind of things i did today or this week today actually but it doesn't okay fuck weekly all right let's talk straight so yeah you can have like these modules and these modules are like okay so you see these workspace module idle inhibitor mpd and 
so these are some modules which you are seeing here and the good thing about you know like this uh, waybar is all this is by default okay i don't have to write scripts like dwm now i know i'm sounding really bad right now like previously i was the one who was saying okay it's so cool you can write script. you can write script but you know like it's easier and it's prettier okay so yeah that's one thing like waybar and uh, the bar on the top and what else like hyperlane config there is nothing to see guys in hyperlane config it's highly default and it's so easy like everything look at these gestures okay so everything you need uh comes by default really easily in hyperlane all right so things like you know like how to manipulate touchpad everything is in the configuration by default so I'll I'll release the hyperlane configuration because I feel like it's almost ready. There is nothing a lot to do. Now let's talk about the main thing, which is wallpapers. Now my channel have like take wallpapers religiously. Okay. So there are many ways to manipulate wallpaper and this thing annoyed me a lot. So one way is hyperpaper. So this is a tool which you can use in this hyperlane. So it's a tool which you can install and use. So I use this because I felt like, okay, it's a uh, hyper land, hyper paper. So this is the best thing to use, but then I realized, okay, I'm not going to give you opinion. It's okay. It's my, it's just my opinion. You have to write config and then you have to type like hyper paper. Now I'm going to run, I'm not going to run it, but then it's going to give you a wallpaper. Now the issue with this thing is that you have to change configuration and, and I didn't find any other way to change wallpaper and it had some confusing terms like first you preload some wallpaper and then I, I mean I understand these things but as a okay I understand but it, it is really confusing for something which can be done really simply I I it's not my opinion okay it is my opinion fuck it all right so one thing I really liked uh not okay I, i'm just switching topic in the on fly so i saw macbook one of my friend had Mac, macbook on trip and that macbook gave me a lot of issues okay so we had pictures on that macbook and it turns out i was giving him, him a hard drive and i asked him to just copy some pictures and he said all right it's macbook so we can't do it i was like what the fuck and and it was so horrible and then i did some scp hack and i just fetched all those like i got all those images okay but it was painful okay so what i did is in firefox i added a extension which is uh, this thing called okay i forgot the extension look at this neon youtube enhancement some of my friends recommended this and i installed this i don't have like i switched my server so i stopped my instance of uh, yt but i really need that like uh, yeah. like the one yt local one so you see this this neon kit you know it's my friend recommended like spend layer he's also a youtuber so what happened is every time i open my firefox it becomes auto full screen okay and i i removed this high toolbar thing all right so why i did that because now it's kind of like mac like in mac when you open your browser it becomes full screen like i feel like browser should always be full screen and it 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 looks better because if you look at my system mostly what i do is i just use one terminal maybe tmux sometimes and just browser okay so one workspace i'm just going to use terminal okay why tmux is destroying everything whatever i'm doing here so you i don't need tmux i i use styling when i'm address all right guys so yeah let me open some site okay so yeah so here i got my browser here i got my terminal okay so this is so weird like some guy just talking about his work environment but i feel that people who are who don't rise and just use default are pussies like what the fuck you're just looking at some screen every day and you're you know there is no eye candy are you like what what the hell is wrong with you just do something and it's fun just make your system look like which reflects your personality it's fun actually it's not it's a lifeless thing okay so let's talk more about the rice oh yeah wallpaper so i really want it i always had this childhood dream like i wanted a live wallpaper like something moving in my wallpaper so then i found this program mpp paper and this triggered me okay so what i can do is with mpv paper 
I can okay so I can give a video and it's going to use MPV and run a you know live wallpaper for example this thing look at this this is so pretty it's isn't it guys so what MPV paper here doing is uh, minus F is for fork so if I can close my terminal and it's still going to run and minus O you can give any MPV flag so I'm giving loop flag and then you have to tell the screen and what is this minus P I, I forgot this MPV paper minus P it's for auto pause okay so every time you open something like Firefox so the background video is going to pause now my fans are literally struggling right now look at this the CPU uses of MPV paper is high as fuck okay so yeah the MPV paper is good but since it's using MPV and this video is actually 4k so this is why it's struggling a lot like if I run any other if I run any other video let me try uh, anyway wallpaper yeah so this video is really chill right okay also I'm using this wall like pie wall theme okay theme Dracula so pie wall have some default like themes let me just show you pie. okay let me yeah so pie wall themes so you can see the previews here let me just quickly show you so yeah most people might don't know this why it's not opening my fans are literally just making noise now I have to should I kill MPV paper MPV paper yeah I killed it why this page is not opening I have no clue so this page okay normally this page get open uh, let me see firewall uh, preview uh, themes preview yeah okay this page is not opening so basically you get list of themes by default in firewall so I am using this Dracula because I had this wallpaper so it was matching but usually I don't use it let me just remove it so ZSH ZSH RC and let me just remove this cat line here yeah that's it so now if I open so this is what by default looks okay so if I go to waybar and just open styles.css so I can just make it a little bit darker with dot nine. yeah now it's a little better let me make it better all right so yeah that's it and other than that okay I mean not okay this is not like that said I have a lot to tell you right now so one thing which I want to tell you is that MPV paper was good but it kind of break my heart heart like it was using so much memory I can't really use it okay I mean I'm not I stopped using DWM it doesn't mean like I am totally now like don't care about memory or stuff I do care about memory so what happened is then I did some research there were some programs for static simple wallpaper but then I found this SWW and it worked really great so right now what I'm using is a SWW okay for this live wallpaper but SW okay yeah what else I did so it's a really minimal daemon so you just have to type like SWW in it and it will run and if I run htop you can see uh, I'm trying to see okay OBS is using so much CPU PSOX wrap S so this is using like really less amount of memory and CPU in comparison to MPV paper so let me show you PS minus U um, home and then I want memory and command of uh, yeah just memory and command grab SW okay this is not how you use you have to pass minus O fuck it okay let me try PS minus E I'm just making okay okay I'm trying to get this from my older command all right fuck it I, I forgot it I don't know so yeah MPV paper was using okay I'm not running MPV but it's SWW yeah so yeah it's using 0.4 memory and trust me it's really less so in comparison to MPV paper it, it is nothing so it is using GIF it have no support for video and we don't really want video wallpaper we we can just convert video into GIF that's what I did so I have this directory okay what directory experiment yeah 
So I, I created some GIF wallpaper for myself and I literally like went to YouTube and just found the best uh, Mr. Word clips and then I downloaded and used some FFmpeg commands to you know just make some really nice GIFs out of it because there were no nice 1080p GIFs online which I could have found for Mr. Word okay so what now I can do is I can type SWW IMG and then some other like Mr. Word JF it's going to take some time it depends on the gif so i literally just made made gifs out of videos so and it was like you know five to ten second videos and 1080p so yeah this is why it is going to take time but look at this so first it's changing and now it's a video all right so i'll show you i'll make video this is so cool like i'm 100 percent going to make video like how you can create gifs out of you know any video so let me show you some more like some darling smoke uh yeah darling smoke yes so there were okay mr word is a really good show with a lot of nice shots and this is why i use like mr words so all right it's going to take time let me think some random bullshit to talk about maybe i can you know i have nothing to say my trip was really awesome guys seriously it was really fun by the way you can subscribe to span the slayer he was with me and he he was a really like he's a really nice okay fuck it this why, why it's taking so much time i guess this is a like a really big clip yeah in this clip i actually slowed everything down and uh, make it like make the saturation a little bit higher so yeah that's cool like now i can you know work while looking at darlene darlene is my favorite okay so what else like i got some other work but let me just show you so this system is right now looking so beautiful in oled i can't explain and uh, i i just love hyperland it's like dream come true and those who don't really like animation i was actually i'm highly confused if you can write some comments telling me like what i should do so i got what i can do is if i go to hyperland and search animation i can disable it uh enabled no okay and then it's like dwm right so i'm highly confused should i do this so there was a meme like red and blue which side are you so this is kind of like this so animations or no animations which side are you on so all right i was showing you some gifs which i have which i created so i okay let me just run it with mpv so i got some lane gif and all these so i downloaded it you might wonder from where i downloaded it it's quite random okay so everything i get got on my computer it's from internet but it's really hard to tell you a specific site okay so again sww img and run something boom it's my system is looking so beautiful I've all, always wanted to, I, I tried this program when I was using DWM, it was a DWM live wallpaper. Also, I really like this way of using Firefox, like uh, without any this thing, because, okay, it's looking good. Uh, so yeah, this, this program, high performance animated wallpaper. But the issue with this is if you try the to blur the terminal it won't work you have to kill the pycom this was a pay this was a program pay-per-view and now when i'm using hyperland i feel like everything is so modern like everything is so like oh okay xor feels so old school now like i can literally do anything in valent it's giving me such such a control so i can use you know like these kind of wallpapers and some other wallpaper i guess that's it i have nothing else to say in this video but maybe i should do these kind of videos more because here i just talk in not like okay i <laughs> same same video like okay let's use some lane lane wallpaper sw2 lane 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 is there any lane uh okay i can't really see gif maybe we can i can use lxiv so this is one issue like i if i use lxiv it's going to give me this black background but you can change it so 
I will change it. So I got this test or GIF which is lame, but you get the idea. Like, yeah, it, it kills the aesthetics, but at least you get the idea. So test or cheer. Let's try it. So SWW and G test or cheer. So all the like hyper my interest of rising, my interest of you know exploring. Um, you know, I, I found that interest again just because of Hyperland. I was otherwise I was completely out of this bubble and I feel so good like on this channel uh, when I started this channel you guys never got to see how I did my rising of TWM or how I did uh, like my my journey of distro hopping or like this this uh, this JF doesn't look as good as other GIFs which I have then maybe I should try those so it's not like I don't work I do a lot of work it's just right now I'm rising, so I'm just focusing on rising. So people who say that risers don't work, I use DWM. I did, I was doing jobs while using DWM, and my friend also do it. So uh, that's not true, guys. Okay, risers also do work, and they work on pretty systems. All right, so it's going to take time. So when this get rendered, like when this get rendered in the background, I'll stop the video uh, right, it's getting rendered i'm not gonna edit this video all right i want this to be as okay this is my favorite wallpaper guys seriously why i haven't showed you this before all right so with this this is the end of what's right weekly and hope you had i don't know okay thanks for watching the video this is so awesome i, I need animations back